Hello everybody, Mr. Porkchop Boy here, and I have a very special video for you today. Today is my 50th video. That's right, 55-0. Now, if you've been with me since the beginning, I really appreciate you watching all my videos, and uh, you might already know what my collection looks like because you watch all my videos. But today I'm going to be doing a full, like uh, a full overview of all my Zippos. And um, all right, so let's start with my first Zippo here. This here is my first Zippo. It is a matte orange Zippo. Take that out of there for you. This is one that I took the sticker out. This is the only one that I ever put Zippo fluid into. Uh, but right now it doesn't have any. You can see in the original box. But I put the stickers over here on the back. Okay. I'm going to try to put this so I can fit all my Zippos in this video. So that is my matte orange Zippo. Then this is my next Zippo I got. This is the Black Crackle Zippo. Great, great Zippo. I also took the sticker off this Zippo. I thought I was going to use it, but I never did. So the it is still brand new. Let's see if I can... There you go. Uh, so it is still perfectly new. It's still not used. Uh, it does have the original box here. I also put the stickers on the back of this box. But uh, I never put in, uh, Zippo fluid in that one. Okay, now for the next Zippo. This is a matte white Zippo. Still has the sticker on the back. Uh, really like this Zippo. If you want to see any of these um, Zippo reviews that I have, I go into depth and I show more detail of them um, in my on my channel. So if you want to go check that out. This is a brushed brass Zippo. It's actually my only brass Zippo. I really like it. And it is the original box, but um, the sticker's still on the back, as you saw there. Okay, next Zippo here is the Toffee Zippo. Really, really like this Zippo. Also does have the sticker on the back. Did not take it out. And it is the original box for this Zippo. Okay, next Zippo here is the Meadow, Zippo Meadow. It is brand new. Okay, and it is the original box. Okay, next, I have here the Zippo Cerulean. Really, really nice. Also, still brand new. And it is still the original box on this one. The only, um, the thing with these three Zippos and this one I have in my hand, they're all from the same uh, collection, I would say. They all have the same uh, texturing and the same uh, clear coat kind of thing, but it's just different colors. This is the Candy Apple Red. Really like this Zippo. Still brand new, as you see there. And it is the original box, okay? Now after this Zippo, I got this Zippo here, which is a 1972 Zippo. So uh, as you can see there, the hinge doesn't close all the way. I'm going to try to fix that. You can see there, there is uh, no wick in there, I took it out. Also, no flint, took it out. So that's the... Uh, 1972 Zippo. Uh, it right now I don't have a box for it because uh, I got it like this. <clears throat> After that Zippo, I got this Zippo here. It is a 1968 Zippo, and over here on this picture here is a is the moon landing when the um, you know when we first landed on the moon in uh, 1969, I believe it was. And um, this Zippo was actually made one year before the decal was put on there or before the painting was put on there. I also don't have a box with that one because um, I got that Zippo uh, from the same place and it's a place that sells gold so he didn't have a box for it. It's like a place where you know you go in sell them your stuff and they give you some money and then you can go there and buy something if you want. Now this is another Zippo I got. This is uh, not the original box for it. Um, doesn't have the paperwork inside but it is brand new. It is a 1937 replica with the slashes on the top and the bottom. Okay. Then, let me just move this over. Then after that Zippo, I got this Zippo here, which also not the original box, but it is this, the replica box. It does have the paperwork in there. And this is a 1941 replica. And it is still brand new also. As you can see there. Okay. 
Now after that Zippo, I got this Zippo here. This is a Millennium Zippo. It was made at the end of 1999 and um, retail price for this Zippo was $25.95. I didn't pay that but uh, yeah, still has a sticker on the back so it's, a, it's an old Zippo here. Then after that Zippo, I got this Miller High Life Zippo. You can see there. Really nice Zippo. This Zippo does have the sticker on the back, but the seal is broken, so it's not, you know, it doesn't stay closed, but it, it is unused. Then after that, I got the Miller Lite can of beer, and it does have the sticker on the back, and it is perfectly fine. Um, did not pay retail for this. It's an uh, older Zippo. This Zippo is from uh, January of 2000, and uh, still has a sticker on the back. And I also got this Zippo Sports Lighter. It has a basketball player on there. On the back, there is no uh, sticker. It is unused, but there is no sticker on there. Then after that, I got this American Flag Zippo here. It also is uh, unused, and I don't. It's not sealed, but I have this sticker right here, as you can see there. I put it inside the case. I mean, if I pull that out, you can see right here. So I have the original sticker for it. It's just not um, on the back. I don't even know how I put this in here before, but I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just going to stick it in there, and then I'll put that in later. So that is my um, American Flag Zippo. And now for my most valuable Zippo, I would say. the I would say the one of the most attractive Zippos I own, and it's... Um, in the original box, I did not do a review on this yet, but I will soon. It's a 1957 Corvette, and I bought this from a uh, antique shop. I paid sixty dollars for this Zippo. And as you can see there, it has a Corvette on there. Let me bring this up closer and zoom, and you can see that Corvette right there, really nice. And uh, it, it is the older box, so it does have the stand. So it is a standing case, as you can see there, and um, it had it, this zipper was from 1993. I just put the little piece of paper in there so I would know. Um, really, really nice zipper. I really like this one. It does not have the stick on the back, but uh, it was never used. And I would say that this is my most valuable stick, um, my most valuable zippo, even if it doesn't have the sticker on it. Um, it, I still think this is my most valuable. Um, it does have the original paperwork on the back. And I really, really like that. Now, one quick thing before I end this video. I have one fake Zippo. Let me just go grab that really quick. Okay, so this is my fake Zippo. It's a belt buckle Zippo. Um, you can tell it's fake. It has a fake chimney. It's thinner in the hand. Uh, but it comes with this belt buckle. So it's a fake Zippo, but it is a Zippo type lighter. And I also have this lighter here, which is a table lighter, an old table lighter. And you press down here, and then the flame would come out right here. So that's a nice one. And if you want to see uh, any of these reviews or closer look at any of these Zippos I have here, I have all the reviews on my channel. The only ones that are not on my channel yet are the Miller Light Can, I believe it's this one. And this one here. Those are the only two that I do not have the um, video for yet. So let me just take this out one more time. Just so you can see. Okay. So total, I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 Zippos. A fake. And here I have a Ronson table lighter. That's, this is a Ronson table lighter. And uh, I did order something else on the internet. Should be coming very soon. Very excited about that. Uh, this video might be a little long. I was trying to go through it pretty quickly. But um, if you're collecting Zippos, let me know in the comment section if you have a Zippo uh, collection update. And I'll go to your channel and check it out because uh, I want to see how other people's collections are going. So this is uh, 18 Zippos, a fake Zippo, and this is a Ronson table lighter. 
And I got all these in the span of, let's see, um, I believe I started collecting Zippos in November. So November, December. So in like three months, I have all these Zippos. Hopefully my collection keeps on growing. I'm very excited that my collection is growing very quickly. I just need a case to put all my Zippos in now, and then I will hang them on my wall. The only Zippo in this collection that I have ever put Zippo fluid into and used is this Zippo uh, Matte Orange. Works great uh, when I have Zippo fluid in it. Right now, obviously, it would obviously light if there was Zippo fluid. Uh, really, really like this Zippo. Still in perfect condition, but uh, just uh, doesn't have any Zippo fluid in there. This is another one of the Zippos that I really, really like a lot. But it doesn't have the stickers right there. So, thank you very much for watching. Go to my channel if you want to see any of these videos. And subscribe for more. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.